To answer the two questions everybody has asked since the beginning of time, yes, all dogs go to heaven, and no, not all dogs are born alike. It turns out that there's a lot more to dogs than Scooby-Doo. Man, I don't care what it looks like, as long as it isn't haunted. <laughs> and that detective dog that Tom Hanks worked with once. From a scary South African watchdog to one of the most famously strong dogs on the planet, let's meet the 15 most powerful dog breeds in the world. <sighs> Number 15. Black South African Mastiff If you've ever seen those shows where dogs do the darndest things, then you'll know one thing. Watchdogs are scary. And the Black South African Mastiff is highly recommended as a watchdog. So, you know, you do the math. Also known as the South African Borbul, this breed is notorious for its incredible physical strength, packed with muscle and highly intelligent to boot. This breed is descended from dogs that once defended the homestead from dangerous predators looking to swoop in and cause untold chaos. Today, they're notorious for being dedicated protectors of their home, which obviously leads to some good things and some bad things. For one, this mighty and intimidating breed can be aggressive and territorial towards, well, anybody. But when you weigh as much as a Great Dane, I don't think I have to explain how dangerous that could be. The Black South African Mastiff is well respected as a watchdog and a protector. And when you have as much muscle and power as this breed, that's not exactly surprising. Now, if it was some kind of cuddly poodle type, that would be a surprise. Man, I hope we have a powerful poodle on this list. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 14. Rottweiler Easily one of the least surprising entries on our list, Rottweilers are well known for being powerful and frightening dogs. Of course, there are many out there that are sweet and gentle and loving, but there are also a lot who will rip your face off if you go to cuddle them. So, you know, be warned. One of the most notable and terrifying features of this powerful breed is that bite. Thanks to their large head size, the Rottweiler's jaws are far stronger than other dogs their size, with a bite force of around 328 pounds. A shark, by comparison, has a bite force of about 669 pounds. Need I say more? Most Rottweilers are trained from a young age to avoid attacking people, but I think we all know that there are some dogs out there who will just do it because, well, they have the bite. Depending on the dog's training, the Rottweiler can be one of the kindest, most adorable dogs in the world, or a genuine terror. But I think we can all agree that any dog with half the power of a shark should be respected and given its own film franchise. Am I right? Honestly, I just don't want the dogs to hurt me. Number 13. Siberian Husky You'd be strong too if you had to pull those huge heaping sleds around all day. Okay, so most modern Siberian Huskies aren't sled dogs, but that's besides the point. These animals were designed to be a strong, capable breed. And guess what? They really are. Over a century ago, the Siberian Husky was bred for strength and agility. <laughs> traits required to pull those sleds far distances in unthinkable conditions. One notable story has the husky delivering a life-saving serum to Alaska, helping to save many lives from a pretty horrific outbreak of diphtheria. That story later became a movie, Palto. But that's for another video. The Siberian Husky is quite literally bred to withstand extreme temperatures and to pull unthinkable weight behind it. I would consider that to be a pretty strong breed of dog, wouldn't you? The Siberian Husky is without a doubt one of the most powerful dogs in the world, even if you're not looking for a dog to pull your sled. Their presence, their company is good enough. Also, there's a movie made after one of these dogs. I mean, come on. Number 12. Boxer 
While they may be related to bulldogs and other similar breeds, the boxer is known for its protective, goofy personality. However, don't get fooled into thinking they're just the fun-loving cousin of the guy with anger issues. These guys can be scary when they need to be. Suppose they happen to encounter some kind of behavior they feel is threatening. In that case, the boxer will launch into the kind of aggressive, territorial approach that one expects from a good, formidable guard dog. <laughs> That's when you see the bulldog side coming out. And believe me, if you happen to get a boxer dog angry at you, it's not a pretty sight. They're very kind and gentle to their family, but they will do anything and everything to protect their loved ones. And I think we all know how that will end for you. The boxer is far from the most intimidating dog in the world. They're actually more well-known for their goofy and fun-loving personalities than their aggression. But when pushed, they can absolutely prove themselves as one of the most powerful breeds on the planet. I don't know that they would be good professional boxers, though. Number 11. St. Bernard The St. Bernard is another example of a gentle giant, a large animal that may seem intimidating. But they're really not. Unless, and you know there's always an unless, well, they have a dark side. But, well, it takes a lot to really unlock it. These dogs are incredibly fond of children and often show exceptional loyalty to their family and loved ones, which can only mean one thing. If that family is put in any kind of danger, well, you better start running. Because when a gentle giant becomes concerned for his family, the cute, gentle part kinda gets thrown aside. You don't mess with a big dog's home and also get to keep your legs. You know, haven't you seen, well, any gangster movie from the past 50 years? It's all right there, only this guy's fluffy. I'm not saying that Beethoven was a danger to his family, I'm just saying that these dogs are exceptionally loyal and will do absolutely anything to ensure and maintain their home and loved one's safety. But you know, if you want to lose your legs, go right ahead. Number 10. Newfoundland Newfoundland is not just a slightly strange island in the middle of nowhere, it's also a dog, and a big one. The Newf, as they're so adorably known, is a massive breed of working dog. And, like all working dogs, it can do a whole lot. The Newfoundland is known for its giant size, intelligence, strength, calmness, and loyalty. But it's not just big and fluffy, it's also a lifesaver, thanks to its unique combination of strength and endurance. <coughs> the Newf is particularly adept at rescuing drowning victims by swimming long distances. So not only do you get to be saved, but you also get a nice fluffy guy to cuddle once you get out of the water obviously. Because of their natural ease in the water, these dogs were once used as working dogs for fishermen. In, you guessed it, Newfoundland. It all comes full circle. The Newfoundland is an adorable, impressive, and honestly incredible dog. It's not every day that you find a big, cuddly teddy bear of a dog that's also capable of saving people's lives. Okay, I guess some people would describe that as their everyday life, but for most of us, it's Netflix and half a pint ice cream. Number 9. Irish Wolfhound Here's a friendly tip for our viewers. Don't mess with a wolfhound. In case you somehow don't get it from the name, these dogs are so powerful. They can take down a wolf or wolves in minutes. It's actually kind of terrifying. While they're generally known to be kind and calm towards their human allies, they're notorious for their fearlessness and their love of chasing, well, anything that happens to move. Whether it's a rabbit, another dog, or another unfortunate human, the wolfhound will chase you, and it will eventually bring you down. And yeah, that experience is as terrifying as you might expect, because I'm really not kidding when I say that these animals are born to win fights against wolf or wolves. They're truly one of the bravest and most terrifyingly powerful dogs on the planet. 
Irish wolfhounds may be pretty terrifying and powerful, but they're also known to be sweet and kind animals to their human friends. Just be sure to stay on the right side of it, and maybe you'll escape the fate of the unfortunate wolf. Maybe. Number 8. German Shepherd What's more powerful, big brains or muscles? Apparently, the real answer is both, and the German Shepherd definitely has both. The German Shepherd has been named as the third smartest breed of dog in the world, but it's also known to be incredibly muscular. So, kinda the best of both genuinely frightening worlds. Back in the day, German Shepherds were developed to be the world's best all-purpose worker dog. And to give them their credit, they definitely tick all the boxes there. <laughs> This breed is intelligent, agile, muscular, and very, very big. Having learned all of that, it makes a lot of sense as to why this particular breed makes for such a popular guard dog. People like a smart dog who isn't afraid to rip apart potential invaders, because let's be honest, if there's one dog you don't want running at you on a dark night, it's a German Shepherd. The German Shepherd is the breed of choice for law enforcement professionals, which is just another sign that these dogs should be respected and feared. Especially if you smell of something you shouldn't. They'll take you down before you can even utter the words, good dog. Number 7. Alaskan Malamute You've seen the Siberian Husky, and now it's time to meet the American version, the Alaskan Malamute. While it's relatively similar to the Husky, the Malamute is even stronger and noticeably more muscular, and honestly, given their history, that makes a lot of sense. Long ago, the Inuit tribes of Western Alaska adopted the Malamute as their dog of choice. the Malamute would hunt for them and carry freight through the impossibly deep snow of Alaska, thereby allowing them to develop the impressive muscles they have today. And when you factor in the insane temperatures of snowy Alaska, and you come to realize just how powerful these animals actually are, I dare any self-respecting Amazon worker to drag a big pile of deliveries through the snow. And tell me it's not difficult. Actually, Amazon workers already know how hard it is to deliver freight. Um, okay, artisan card designers, accept my challenge. While the Malamute may seem relatively similar to the Husky, it's a whole other breed of dog. And boy does it deserve your respect. Today, these beautiful dogs can be found all over the world, mostly as pets, because, you know, there's not a lot of snow in Australia. Number 6. Tangle Let's be honest here, any animal that is selectively bred for hundreds of years will be something formidable. They're just built to be superior. The Kangal is one of those animals, a breed of dog designed to be the best, and also to take down anybody that stands in its way, also toys. The Kangal is a powerful, big guard dog that originated in Turkey, where it was selectively bred for strength and temperament. Thanks to all that centuries-long hard work, the Kangal is now in an elite club of dog breeds, the pups that can take down predators. The Kangal can take on large predators like bears and wolves and easily come out on top. That's insane, I know, but it's also absolutely true. These dogs are trained to take down anything that could pose a potential threat to their home and family, no matter their enemy's size or power. Whether or not you think the Kangal is a safe animal to bring home, I think we can all agree that this is a formidable and powerful dog. I mean, Scooby-Doo would be running for the dang door if he got in a fight with a Kangal. It's not even close. Number 5. Rhodesian Ridgeback Yes, it does sound like the name of a turtle, but I checked multiple times. It's definitely a dog. The Rhodesian Ridgeback is a stunning breed of dog originating in Africa. And boy, are they something to behold. The Rhodesian Ridgeback was originally bred to guard livestock and homes in what we now know as Zimbabwe and Zambia. But it was also used to track and hunt lions in the wild. That kind of training has made the Rhodesian Ridgeback the dog that it is today. A formidable, 
strong and muscular guy who will not hesitate to protect his family. And yes, they're definitely good at hunting. Any intruder that happens to cross one of these guys is in for a surprise, especially if they've been poorly trained. That burglar surely won't be walking away anytime soon. This may well be your first time hearing about the Rhodesian Ridgeback, but if so, let me leave you with this. This dog is intelligent, it's intimidating, it can take down a lion. What more is there to say other than try not to make it angry? It's like a mini Hulk. Number 4. Cane Corso If you're looking to adopt your first dog, here's a free tip. Do not get a Cane Corso. It will end badly for you, but for everybody else, feel free to take the risk. Although we should add legally that we take no responsibility for any medical mishaps. The giant Cane Corso is a dog that dates back to ancient Rome and is more well known for its incredible talent as a guardian. Whether it's protecting their humans or protecting their homes, these 100 pound plus behemoths do a phenomenal job of scaring away predators. And yes, it's an unbelievably powerful guy because it has such a bossy, dominant personality, it's not recommended for first-time dog owners and can cause severe harm to humans or other animals if poorly trained and left alone. So I guess you can consider this a warning. Beware the cane. If trained properly, the cane corso can be one of the sweetest, loveliest pets in the world. Or it can be a terror. The choice is up to the owner. But to everybody else, you should probably keep your distance. Number 3. Doggo Argentino It's not just a dog with a pretty name. The Doggo Argentino is one of the world's most intimidating dogs you can hope to find in the world. And perhaps, most incredibly, it did not seek that reputation out for itself. Questionable owners did. Initially, the Doggo Argentino was bred to hunt wild boars and be nice and friendly towards humans. But that all changed when dog fighters adopted the Doggo as their warrior of choice. <laughs> destroying the breed's reputation in the process. Because of this long dog fighting history, the breed is actually banned in many countries around the world, including the UK, New Zealand, and Singapore, to name but three. In the countries where the dogs aren't banned, they tend to be used for police work, so I guess they're going to rip somebody apart no matter what. The doggo Argentino is fundamentally a friendly animal, but there's no question that many have kept capitalized on its powerful nature for their own purposes. I guess the lesson here is that if you happen to see a doggo Argentino in the wild, you're probably going to be blacking out in a matter of seconds. Number 2. Doberman Pinscher let me just say this up front. The Doberman Pinscher is the Meryl Streep of the dog world. And no, I have not lost my mind. Well, not entirely. This is an incredible versatile dog, used for everything from police work to guiding the blind. They're also very powerful. Not likely, Meryl. The Doberman Pinscher is a fiercely loyal dog, noted for its incredible intelligence and strength. It's often been said that these dogs are so smart that they tend to get bored and outsmart their owners. But you should never underestimate the power of a Doberman. <laughs> These dogs were once bred to be personal guards, so they're not really afraid of fighting. And because they're highly athletic, they could probably take down a whole group of people multiple times before they get tired. That's frightening, actually. I said it before, and I'll repeat it. The Doberman is Liam Neeson in Taken. The Doberman is easily one of the most loyal and fierce dogs in the world, and it will not hesitate to cause some injuries if the situation calls for it. Or if they get bored. It's really a coin toss, honestly. Number 1. Great Dane Yes, Scooby himself is a force to be reckoned with, and not just when he's hungry. The Great Dane is most well known for being a joyous, friendly people pleaser, but they're also excellent guard dogs for the home, thanks to their history. Like many other powerful dogs, the Great Dane was initially bred to hunt animals like wild boar, 
deer, and bears. But over time, they were domesticated to the adorable animals we know and love today, who are more content to lounge around with their family. But the muscle is still there, all 175 pounds of it. While they may not spend their days attacking animals anymore, they're still impressively powerful animals that could cause a lot of damage if they so desired. Thankfully, they're pretty happy with their modern, relaxed, day-to-day -day lifestyle, Scooby Snacks and all. It's fascinating to think that centuries ago, Mystery Inc. would struggle to solve even the most basic of mysteries with a dog that just kept attacking animals. But nowadays, that's not a problem. What would we do without Scooby Snacks, eh? Which of these powerful dogs is your favorite? Let us know in the comments. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time.